Hello everyone, this is AJ from CCIE, the beginning.wordpress.com. So let's start uh, labbing uh, with GNS3 and uh, Docker. So uh, here uh, I have cloned uh, the repository containing all the needed uh, all needed files for uh, our lab. So let's take a look uh, first uh, at uh, our images. So these are the images I have um, in my machine. So of course you will have to build them. So it will take uh, maybe 10 up to even 15 minutes uh, to build all the, these images. But uh, this will be done only, only once. And uh, then you can uh, spawn your containers from them uh, immediately. Okay, so uh, as you can see, there is no running images, uh, containers, and no uh, stopped containers. So let's uh, take a look at the script of the lab. So uh, these are um, the command used to automate. Uh, uh, launching uh, the containers so um, uh, I'm checking uh, whether uh, these images exist if not uh, they are built and then um, I'm launching uh, a console for each container and changing uh, the interface and the IP address and um, uh, as well uh, a new gateway pointing to uh, the appropriate GNS3 uh, device IP. So let's uh, launch the script. So here you can see uh, the consoles uh, have started. This is the GUI uh, container of uh, Firefox so we can check uh, the uh, the server the apache server so these are ip addresses configured with uh, pipework uh, now let's um, start GNS3. So I have already configured uh, the lab with uh, a very simple topology. So these uh, are two routers configured with uh, IPv4 and IPv6 um, addresses. So these are the cloud uh, linked to uh, the bridge interfaces used for uh, with our uh, containers, and these are the uh, uh, default gateway IPs to which the containers are pointing. So for example, here is 66.100 is a, a router IP uh, address. Okay, so let's check uh, the connectivity between uh, the containers. So for example, let's ping uh, this 51.1 uh, .1 from uh, uh, this container 44.1 now let's uh, check the the path so as you can see uh, the traffic is routed through uh, GNS3 topology.
so here the base image uh, I'm using have uh, a couple of uh, uh, useful tools like for example MTR, uh, trace path, uh, trace, trace path, uh, trace route 6 here let's uh, take a look at uh, the IP addresses so these IP IPv6 addresses are automatically generated by Pipework using the uh, the third uh, octet of the uh, IPv4 as you can see the this uh, 55 so and using a trace uh, trace route you can see that uh, the IPv6 traffic is routed through uh, GNS3 topology so this is uh, MTR for IPv6 so this uh, uh, ba the, the base container and the image used by this container can be uh, can be used uh, for GNS3 as a, a host and we can spawn as many hosts as we as we want so let's uh, check the uh, Apache server so we have launched the server and now we are testing it uh, through uh, from uh, the Apache and the, um, the Firefox container so this works as well using IPv6 here we go I have also included uh, a couple of uh, uh, SIP uh, command line applications for example let's test it so this is a let's let's make a, a peer-to-peer connection between uh, two containers using using SIP uh, application so this is the first container we are launching uh, SIP as server and for the other container we are launching SIP as a client so it will generate um, calls to the destination where the server is, uh, is executed so as you can see uh, the client is generating calls to uh, the other container so here so as you can see we are receiving messages already between the two uh, peers So these are statistics of incoming and outgoing calls between the two peers. Okay, so here I'm launching uh, the SIP application, but this time the destination is uh, a soft phone, a SIP soft phone inside the host, and uh, as you can see. Uh, the host is receiving the phone uh, the phone call so here each time I'm, I'm declining or answering the the uh, uh, I'm declining uh, the call so it generate uh, another and so on so as you can see uh, we can uh, generate uh, calls between uh, the container and uh, an outside outside um, uh, voice over IP uh, client through GNS3 so it will continue uh, generating calls
so this uh, can be very useful to uh, generate many uh, SIP uh, clients inside um, GNS3 uh, without uh, without uh, building an entire virtual machine to just test for example this uh, Linphone application or or voice over IP okay so that's it for this lab and uh, see you next time guys bye